Hey, Felix, what's this thing? Yeah, Ben, um, Weller was kind enough to send to us the Zero Smog Fume Extractor. Oh, so you can suck up the fumes that come off solder. Mm -hmm. I like to preserve my, my respiratory system as much as possible. Yeah, you have like that little uh, PC fan you rigged up back yep. in the day. Yeah, I, I use that. So this is a proper way of doing it. Mm -hmm. Not only does it suck up the fumes, it also filters them. Yeah, this is pretty awesome. It's got a dust filter, a uh, HEPA filter, and a... Uh, Let's take a look. An active charcoal filter Let's in Let's literally look under the hood. Yes. Ah, so this must be the dust filter. Mm -hmm. And then in here is the... Looks like, you know, installation. This is the HEPA filter oh, and nice. charcoal filter. Now, how, how long do these filters last? This is good for a year. Oh, is that a... Oh yeah, they've got a foam seal at the top and the bottom. Yep. That makes sense. Oh, it's made out of particle board. Interesting. Yeah. And this is the main vacuum down here? Yep. So we could just turn this on without the filter if we wanted, can we? Yeah, let's see how hard she chooches. Try the, uh, the adjustment for the... Yep, I'm reducing the speed. It's actually pretty quiet once you have it, you know, everything closed up. Mm -hmm. So it's got some nice vibration shock mounting oh, yeah. here. That's pretty awesome. Use it during an earthquake. Cool. Well, should we uh, see how well it can extract fumes? Iceberg right ahead! Should we go uh, start? Full reverse speed! Oh, full reverse. Yeah. On British! Well, Felix, we mounted this to the table. Looks like it has a master flow valve right here. To open and close it. Yeah, that could be helpful. All right. It's got that nice uh, little flat edge there. Yeah, I think so that's it can... so it can uh, go right against the table. Oh, there yep. we go. That's mm -hmm. that's the stuff. Cool. All right, let's see if we've got some suction here. All right, it is definitely pulling air it. through. Yeah, it's on one of the lower settings. We also have the new Weller TP65 soldering iron with digital display and standby features. This thing is sweet. Oh, there you go. See. Yeah, it's nice. I like that a lot. wonder how far away that actually works. Let's try it over here. This is my first time soldering with this iron. It's a little out of range. We could try increasing the suction. Yeah, let me go do that. Yeah. Whoa, look at that. See how far it... Yeah, it's probably about eight inches. There it's getting it. Let's crank it up. Okay. Okay, yeah, it's taking it pretty easily. It I'm, I'm gonna take it all the way to the top end. Okay. We're still going up. Yeah, look, see it's going up and yeah, then it's coming it. back down. Here, I just make a lot of smoke. So I'm gonna do a test. I'm gonna get really close to it and we'll see if it pulls it away from my face. All right, here we go. So I like to have my face right in it. Oh yeah, that's pulling it away long before I could breathe it in. Yeah, the motor's pretty quiet. Yeah. I think those rubbery feet have a lot to do with that. It reminds me of the CNC machine, like where the material being cut is louder than the motor is. Felix, any final thoughts on the Weller Zero Smog system? I think this is really great. Um, they took into account a lot of uh, different aspects, like the uh, the grounding strap and the extra, uh, the remote switch. Oh yeah, so you don't have to just go around there all the mm -hmm. time. Yeah, because honestly, if you're using this, you're probably going to have one speed setting that you use most of the time yeah. based off yeah. your soldering style. Okay, well, thanks Weller for sending us this Zero Smog Fume Extraction System. You can find this device and other Weller products on element14.com.